Hey folks, it's Ken. Happy Saturday. How you guys doing out there? I'm in my garage in my workspace to flash out this guy here and this guy over here. These are two skeletons, or two skulls rather, I've had hanging around the garage for a few years, just kind of hanging out in the shelf. And it's time to repurpose them. This guy here I bought, he's uh, made of foam. And I wasn't quite sure why. I liked it at the time, but he hasn't really done much. But again, I think I stuck him in a tree last year and put some lights on him as a little creepy little, you know, haunt in my yard for Halloween. But I'm going to repurpose this guy. Now this one here, you might be able to notice, he's got a bunch of clay stuck in him. Okay. What I've done with this guy in the past is I built him up with clay, with a just a water-based clay, sculpted on top of him, and in doing so, created a sculpture of a, of a spooky face, spooky head. Then I got plaster, plaster of Paris, and made a mold and used that mold to make latex masks. Sort of like this. Check this out. So here is a plaster mold I made. You can see the inside of it, if you can, possibly. But if you picture it, this thing had clay on it, and so I kind of rested in here. Then when the plaster hardened, I ripped out the plastic skull and all the clay, cleaned out the mold, and I was able to put latex into it and make latex masks. That's what I did. But I'm getting away from latex masks this year, and I decided I'm going to go with just working with latex and cotton balls and just different techniques to flesh out these guys right here. Okay, you may have seen already I made this guy. I think he's pretty cool. Now for this guy, this is a plastic pumpkin, and I used the plaster bandages. These guys right here, behind my shoulder. Okay, so I got plaster bandages. And then on this cat right here, this guy, all that fleshy goodness on him, I used cotton balls and latex, rubber latex right here that I bought at the old Michael's craft store. Okay, so what I'm going to do right now, I'm going to stop, come back in a few minutes. It'll be it'll be a second for you guys, but it'll be a little while for me. I'm going to use the rubber latex and the cotton balls. See, essentially, I'm going to take a layer of rubber latex and paint it all over this guy and this guy. Then unwrap the cotton balls and lay it on top. I put a layer of rubber latex on top of that and let it harden in front of my handy dandy fan right there okay so then you check it out see what it looks like and tomorrow we'll paint it but right now i'm going to pause and bulk up these guys and i'll see you guys in a second okie dokie hang tight <laughs> 